Right YouTube, how you guys doing? Today I've got the review for the log main application for the iPad. Most of you do know I've done the review for this earlier on uh, for the iPhone and iPod Touch. I'm a big fan of it and when I heard log main were doing an application for the iPad I was equally if not more excited and hopefully this video will give you some insight as to what it is and what it can do uh, and in a nutshell what, it, what the application allows you to do is, is to remote access to your desktop or your laptop so if you are in a situation where you've got a laptop and a Mac Pro or a MacBook or you've got a desktop, an iMac or a Mac Pro and you've got an iPad you can essentially see your desktop, view your files of your computer on your iPad which is pretty cool uh, the UI of it is fantastic and the price point of this thing is absolutely brilliant so let's take a look at the application in a bit more depth so once you're logged into the log main application it's very simple as you can see everything you're seeing on here is basically a, a copy of this it's remotely hooked up to the MacBook Pro uh, and one of the gripes that I had with the log main application for the iPhone and iPod Touch not a huge gripe but the, the thing is size um, to look at 3.5 inch screen and then to come on to 9.7 inch screen is quite significant uh, size does matter in uh, this instance and I would highly recommend it it's perfectly um, good in those situations where maybe you've forgotten a file in your house, you've got your iPad with you, simply remotely access your uh, MacBook or your desktop or whatever it may be and then email that file across yourself or even better just show the file on your iPad while you're remotely connected. It's straightforward. It's also good in that uh, if you've got parents who aren't tech savvy and you want to help them out or they are in need of help, Install LogMain on the computer and then you can remotely access their computer and help them out. You don't need to uh, phone them up and then go through troubleshooting steps and so on. You do everything, less time is wasted. The LogMain application is also quite handy if you want to see what is going on at your main location. If you happen to stay in student accommodation and want to see who's in your room doing what, you can simply go into photo booth and see who's behind the, the camera or who's behind your system and as you can see the video is obviously going to be laggy but it's not enough laggy to say uh, it's not worth it I, I totally think it's worth it and I'm happening to be making a video for you guys live and you can see me clearly, you can see who's behind the screen doing what and that is pretty cool so let's get out of the photo booth and you quit photo booth and there we go you might want to see something uh, on the desktop. Simply minimize this. And you have your desktop. And uh, well, I've got, I've got system preferences open, but you get the point. You might have an important file on your desktop and you want to copy that over or do something with it, hence why you're doing remote access. The log main application has got settings at the bottom and you've got a full size keyboard here again it's kind of self explanatory as to why you would want a keyboard you've got a mouse you've got a zoom in zoom out function and um, I don't tend to use that I just tend to use this here uh, I think I prefer that much more over than um, this button here but hey if you want to use that go ahead you've got some advanced settings here and basically colour quality so if you're in an area where Wi-Fi is really really rubbish you would want to choose low quality so it's not lagging as much uh, so if you choose low quality it would load up the pages faster and if you're in a hurry you might want to set it as such the resolution is pretty self-explanatory I've set it to the standard 1440 by 900 go back network speed again quite self-explanatory blank screen, lock keyboard and all of these settings are fairly straightforward and um, there's, needless to say, um, they are quite good. So for $17.99 you're getting a full uh, sort of software to keep in sync with your machine at home or your workplace or wherever it may be. And uh, thanks for tuning in. You can end my session now. Disconnecting and you're back onto the main screen. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching. If you happen to use any sort of um, remote access software, if you've happened to use LogMeIn before, do let me know in the comments below. And uh, do join me on iGlassWegion.com, Twitter.com slash i6GlassWegion. And uh, thanks for tuning in. Cheers.